It, it shouldn't be mandated in case of you using an operating system. And I think that's where people are pushing back on. So Windows 11 came with some hardware restrictions. Um, you know, the building, the AI ready baseline, TPM, you know, 2.0, secure boot and strict CPU requirements don't just improve security. They also push users into a standardized modern platform that fits Microsoft's AI first roadmap, leaving capable or older PCs behind and making the shift feel forced. So what Microsoft is doing, they say, well, if you want to run Windows 11, you're going to have to meet a standard in terms of CPU performance. You're going to have to meet a standard of different hardware requirements. And so if you're holding holding an older PC that you probably paid a lot of money for just a few years ago, you know, it's obsolete. And so if you want to run Windows 11, which many, many folks that are moving are basically running the PC platform are going to be forced to move to pretty quickly. Uh, many cases that means gonna that means you're forced to buy a new PC. And of course, okay, well, PC is a thousand bucks. You know what's the big deal, Dave? Well, if you're a small business or you're a large company, you know that drives a lot of churn. You're going to have to update, you know, millions and millions of dollars in equipment. And in many cases, you're not going to get the equivalent value that's going to come back from those upgrades. And to many users, it feels like the shell is being redesigned to feature co-pilot and engagement surfaces while sacrificing customization and efficiency. So many are using Windows 11, you know, feel like their user interface has been hijacked and what they used to be able to do uh, and customize a great deal on the Windows 10 platform, they can't necessarily do that in Windows 11, at least not up to their satisfaction. But users just feel they don't want it. And that's why there's a tremendous amount of pushback these days. But it, it shouldn't be mandated in case of you using an operating system. And I think that's where people are pushing back on. So